Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang. We're here to talk about how to find the cubic foot of something. Now, cubic feet, or cubic foot, depending on you know what it is that you're looking for, is only used in three-dimensional um, measurements, finding the volume of an object, for example. So when it comes to finding cubic feet, that's really the only way that you're going to be able to get that. So, for example, if you want to find the volume of a box, you want to be sure that each dimension is in feet measurements. So if you have 3 feet times 10 feet times 5 feet, assuming you have length, width, and height of a box respectively, you want to multiply all the numbers, but you also want to multiply by the individual units themselves. So for example, 3 times 10 is 30, times 5 is 150. And then to get the cubic feet, feet foot times foot is, is square feet, and then square feet times another foot is cubic feet. So this is another way of saying 150 cubic feet. So the bottom line is, to find the cubic foot of something, you really need to involve volume into the discussion. So I'm Jimmy Chang, and that's a brief example as to how to find the cubic foot of something.